Hey, future robot masters, ever wonder how all those cool robots actually work? Today, we are demystifying something called Robot Operating System, or ROS. And here's a secret. It's not an operating system like Windows or Mac OS. So, what is ROS? Think of it like the ultimate middleware for building robots. It's a bunch of software libraries and tools that help different parts of a robot, the hardware and various pieces of code, talk to each other seamlessly. Imagine a robot trying to grab a ball. You've got a camera seeing the ball, motors moving the robot, and an arm reaching out. How do these distinct hardware components and their controlling software communicate and coordinate? That's where Ross steps in. In ROS, these individual brains or functions are called nodes. Each node does one specific job, like controlling the wheel or processing camera images. And guess what? They can be programmed in Python or C++. Super flexible. Now, how do these nodes chat? Through topics. Think of topics like different radio channels. One node publishes information to a topic, and other nodes subscribe to that topic to receive the info. It's a bus for nodes to exchange messages. For example, our image processing node publishes image data to an image topic, and our control node subscribes to it to get that data. This is one of the main ways data moves between different parts of the system. Simple, right? And what about the messages? They have a specific format so everyone understands, like sending plain text or even memes. Publishers and subscribers must send and receive the same type of message to communicate. This makes sure all the robot's parts are speaking the same language. Building with ROS is organized in something called a workspace. It's like a big folder for all your robot projects, containing different organized nodes into packages. And to get everything running smoothly, we use launch files. These are super handy scripts that let you start up multiple ROS nodes and their configurations simultaneously. It's like hitting one button to bring your robot to life. So whether you're building a delivery robot or a dancing bot, ROS provides the open source middleware tools you need for your next robotics adventure. It's what makes complex robots, both hardware and software, communicate and cooperate seamlessly. Ready to dive into the world of robotics? Follow Manchester Robotics for more.